building ad groups. In a previous video, we touched on the idea of creating a campaign. Now we are uh, we have processed that that first campaign, and now we are building an ad group. An ad group, you can have multiple ad groups in a campaign, hundreds, thousands. So let's say uh, we started with Reseda Plumbing. We're imagining that we're plumbers in Reseda, and that we want to target all of uh, our potential audience out there, people we can service. So what do we do? How do you build an ad group? What's advised? For us, the advice we give uh, those small businesses we consult with, what we do is we, again, think of, and we stressed this in the last video, we'll do it again. Think of the problem, every single problem that you're solving. If you're a service provider, if you are a product creator, you are essentially providing a service or product that solves a problem. Uh, think of each problem as a uh, an ad group and write highly specific ads that speak to each uh, particular keyword. I know it takes a lot of time but it's the way we do it so if, if we're talking about Reseda Plumbing that would be the ad group. The headline um, again this is good the headline and here's what your ad is going to look like the headlines going to speak to the keyword so yeah if you're talking about plumber and Reseda uh, obviously you're going to speak somehow uh, to that audience uh, best plumber and Reseda something like that and you'll test these what's beautiful about this platform it allows you to split test different ads and you'll see as you move through as you process a few ads and run some traffic uh, you can play A, B, A, B, C test different ads and you obviously want the highest click-through rate example uh, obviously your description is going to speak to your service whatever it is your abilities your display URL versus the destination URL well if your destination is um, www com. Let's just imagine that it is. Uh, your display URL will likely be the same. Now, this is important, especially for local providers. Let's just say, let's say that you service the San Fernando Valley and its 20 plus cities, and you want specific pages on your site that speak to people in specific cities rather than the entire valley as a whole. Well, your destination URL may be receiveplumbing.com forward slash um, whatever city it is. Let's say the, a neighboring city, Tarzana. And best plumber in Tarzana is uh, what this ad group is serving. So you, your display URL can be different than your destination URL because your destination URL can be a specific page and a page can have an extension beyond the .com, obviously, right? A website can, like a Wikipedia, has millions of pages. It's wikipedia.org forward slash uh, Abraham Lincoln, whatever it may be. Uh, so you're, there can be a difference, bet difference between your destination and display URL. Your description obvi obviously <coughs> should continue to speak to uh, the person who's searching a specific term and looking to solve a problem. Uh, in terms of keywords, let me just put in some filler here. Let us help you. So keywords, best plumber, we're doing in Tarzana, just for the sake of argument. So we have to plug in keywords, the best place to get keywords, the keyword tool, go in here, do some homework, figure out which keywords are bringing in traffic, what the cost is, and then play around with your cost settings, and you're good to go. Uh, be careful up front, make sure you, you uh, handle a budget that's responsible to you and your family don't don't go crazy google can spend every dollar you have 
uh, within hours no matter how wealthy you are they have that sort of traffic so make sure you understand if you are uh, if you're a local provider make sure you're geo-targeting go back and make certain that you're speaking to a specific area don't run uh, plumbing clicks across the nation when you're working in a particular region if you are a clothing uh, or some sort of product provider that's national be very careful up front again those clicks will uh, come in a hurry and there is a slight lag between when Google uh, charges you for those clicks and then when the, the platform processes those so uh, be certain that you do this uh, with some caution and give yourself a couple days of testing to feel out the process before you really jump in